When we explore nature, we often look up at towering mountains, soaring birds, branches reaching for the sky. But in March 2024 in Big Bend National Park, Deb Manley chose to look down instead. She spotted a fuzzy little plant, photographed it, and uploaded those images to iNaturalist. There, the online community of naturalists quickly realized that this was not just any plant. Deb had documented the first new plant species found in a U.S. national park in nearly 50 years. Meet the woolly devil, scientific name Ovicula biradiata. It's an entirely new genus in the sunflower family, and it's named for its fuzzy coating and its horn-like florets. It was also found near a place in the park known as Devil's Den. Some community members had seen this plant before, but when Deb uploaded her observation to iNaturalist, it kicked off a formal species description process. Pretty soon after, more people started uploading sightings of this plant to iNaturalist, immediately showing that the range of the plant was even bigger than scientists initially thought it was. There are still lots of questions to be answered about the woolly devil, but one thing we do know for sure is that even in our most studied, most visited natural spaces, there are still discoveries to be made, and questions to be answered. Like how many other plants, insects, mollusks, fungi, and even more still remain undocumented? And how many might vanish before we even know they exist? There is still hope though, because every observation shared on a naturalist brings us closer to answering these kinds of questions. And the more community scientists we have out there looking both up and down, the better.